Hello my convicts, yes it is I, the Cup of Convict, bringing you guys another Battlefield 1 gameplay. But how long have I been away from Battlefield? Now there's a big update that was on I had to wait for, which is the reason why this is so late into the afternoon. But what the hell? I never knew about this, but what the hell? I am so confused right now, guys, because this apparently is a thing now. Specializations. What the hell is this? So you can now... In Coming damage from explosives is reduced by 10%. Cover incoming suppression is reduced by 25%. And quick gen decreases time before out of combat heal by 20%. And then there's quick unspot, bayonet training, hasty retreat, inconspicuous, juggernaut, and control demolition. What the hell is this? I'm not sure. It's completely new to me. I've never seen this before in my life, so I've played one game on here, and to be honest, I didn't like it. Now, I was trying to be a medic, and are the medics being nerfed? Because they are rubbish now, absolutely rubbish. I'm using assault at the moment, but I'm not a big fan of these new introduced introduce sort of like perks, because like with anything, you introduce perks, they're going to start making people OP if they've got the correct perk. And against other people, I'm not liking this, so I'm not sure. Let me know guys what you think of this, but that is kind of weird. Having perks in the game, that's, that change the combat, so that someone can take more damage from explosives. Maybe regenerate their health quicker than others. I'm not sure if that's a good thing. Anyway, let's get into the game and let's try and figure out about this game and about all the changes they've made to Battlefield 1. So let me know, guys, what do you think of these changes? Because so far, I'm not liking that idea. But we'll run with it and see where we get. So let's hope and pray. Get out of my face, boy. Just throw that there a moment. As a distraction. Where are you? Come on. Okay, I'm gonna go this way. So I'm assuming you've got to do some sort of challenge to unlock the other perks. But it's really odd. I'm not sure what the perks do. We'll have a quick read through them at the end. Just to give you an idea of what you might be going against when playing Battlefield 1. Because I want to know, because I don't know, to be honest. I've not played it, so I don't know what the perks are. I don't know what they do. I've, I've read very briefly what mine do. So, it, in, you know, I can reduce the flak. Quick regen, so decrease time between uh, before out of combat heal. Enemy team is in and lead. incoming suppression is reduced by 25%. So, I'm not sure guys, I'm not sure. But, could it be good or could it be bad? I'm not sure. I knew there was something about maybe uh, reducing, making the medic a bit better. I thought they said it was going to do. Make them a little bit stronger. Because the medics are probably one of the weakest. Because they've got those rifles that just do single shots. You can get killed by the Automatico, and they did say it was going to nerf the Automatico and make it less good, which is good. Hopefully they did some up with the shotguns as well, because the shotguns were crazy uh, at some points. Right, where are they? No, okay. Got a friend hiding up there, have you? Not for long. Oh, well, there's a guy in there already, I think. So, he's been taken care of. Ooh, God, you died fast. You can die now, my friend. Get out of it. Buddy boy. Anyone got any heals? Ah, oh, behind you. There you go, buddy. Tell your mama saved your life. Oh, oh, bomb. The enemy is in the lead. Let's get out of here. Oh, God, no, that's not good that way. 
Let's just chill here a moment. I'm coming back in. Am I safe? I am for now. I think I saw someone go that way. I really want to leave now. And there is a dude over here. Okay. And they've got new guns. Our side is in the Are these guns... Can you win these guns? Or do you have to buy them? Do you have to do challenges to get these? Because I like the idea of new guns. Oh, okay. So you can. Perform 15 kills with the MP18. And perform 10 kills with the anti-tank grenades. And that's going to be annoying. Anti-tank mine. Oh, anti-tank grenade. Oh, it's the anti-tank grenade. Okay. That is not too bad. So MP18 trench. Okay, let's do that. So let's see if we can start our way to getting some of these new weapons. Because I like new weapons. But having these new perks, I'm not sure if I like them or not. But like I said, um, I'm going to have to go with it for now. And then just see how it plays out. But I'm not sure if there's going to be any like OP perks that you can actually get. That's going to make you like really strong. And if you can pick what your perks are. And have like a really strong setup. So you can like be almost invincible to grenades, heal really quick and then do something else kind of crazy. Like reload faster or shoot faster for the first two bullets or something stupid, I don't know. I'm just guessing, but that's the kind of idea I've got from these new perks. There we go. So we got the trench version, I believe, haven't we? So it's better for firing. There's a dude here. Hello. I believe there was one over here somewhere. Oh, yeah, he's up there. Hello. Um, no one else now? No? Okay. Remember, all the trench guns are usually better for hip firing rather than uh, actually aiming. Obviously, with that, you've got to be close and just burst fire if you're going to use it for long range. But I can't believe they've added all these new things in, and I don't even know. I was completely oblivious. Well, it knows I'm here now. Uh oh. No, you don't. Whoa. No, you don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, you can. You can kill me. Eventually. I was doing pretty well there for myself, but... Okay. I'm very tempted to try out the other perks, but I, I don't know what they are. Let me... I'm going to actually pick a different person after this and see what the medic has. And see what the difference would be if I was to be now the medic. But I did play a game just not long ago, just a little test game, and I didn't like the medic at all. Okay. So, as you can tell guys, don't shoot that from fire because it's crap. Right, so what does a medic have? It has the same, okay. Increase maximum sprint speed while suppressed. The service assignment is locked. Complete 3 out of 5 getting started assignments to begin progress progressing this assignment. But how do you do that? The enemies have almost won. I don't know. Uh, let me pick a different gun. I'm going to go for... I'm going to go for the sweeper. Here we go. There we go, boys. I'm a medic. I don't think we've got any medics on our team. No, we haven't. They're all assault. Is that because the medic's really bad now? <laughs> well, the sweeper's not bad. The sweeper's not changed. No. 
must remember you can actually hold this like an assault rifle and just hold the trigger in. Oh, that's uh, friendly. I can hear people, but I just can't see anybody. Let's go this way. No? Ooh, there's one going across the bridge. Can we spy him? I'm spying him, but they won't spot him. Well, they didn't fix that, did they? They didn't fix the spotting in the game. Is he dead? Oh, there's a dude up there. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. We're back. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. I better get out of there. Huh? No one come yet? No? No, you don't. No, never else. I wish they'd stop the music. Because the music is very distracting. I can't even hear them. And there we go. Wow, that is loud. I must uh, turn my, mus my volume down a little bit on here. But that is crazy. So there's... There's now perks in the game. That's better. It's more like it. Hopefully that's it. That's better. That is somewhat better. So there we go guys. So what do you think guys to these new perks added into the game? Are they groundbreaking? Are they going to break the mechanics of the game? Because like I said, if someone has a specific perk that's really, really good. How is it going to play against someone else who doesn't have that? I know you obviously can get them, but I don't know how. It doesn't actually tell you how you actually get these perks. So let me know in the comments, guys. How do you get these new additions, these new perks that apparently you can get? Next will be having where you can call in UAVs and lightning strikes and God knows what. It'll be going all Call of Duty. You know, Greg, drop me in a lightning strike. And thanks, son. Bring in the artillery, blow up that building. You know, <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know why they've added them in. I guess it's an interesting change. And I guess I'm a bit of a funny duddy when it comes to change. I don't like something to be changed too much because I enjoy a game as it is. I kind of get set to a game to how it plays and I like to keep it that way. When they start changing the mechanics of a game, which I believe the specializations do do that. It's like here, quick spot, decrease length of time you are spotted by two seconds. So if someone can spot you for two, you can use that to be spotted two seconds less. Bayonet training, bayonet charge lasts one second longer and covers one second quicker. So you can run further with a bayonet and obviously you can then use it again quicker. Hasty retreat, increase maximum sprint speed while, su uh, while suppressed by 10%. Inconspicuous, when stationary or moving slowly, you are invisible to spot flares. Okay. Down squad mates within 20 meters drop smoke to cover their revival. And after reviving an ally, you both gain a 20% boost in speed, uh, sprint speed for 8 seconds. So you can revive someone and then you can run 20% faster for 8 seconds. I can't see anything too groundbreaking in them. But I don't know. It, it, I'm not sure how, you know, whether or not I would like that or not. But apparently you've got to complete these assignments. I don't know the what the assignments are. Struck first. Anyway, let's jump back in and do the last gameplay for you guys. So hopefully you enjoyed. If you do, don't forget to hit that like. So let's get on with some more. Advanced Battlefield 1. Uh, I'm going to use support this time. The enemy is in the lead. It's alright. We'll, we'll get them back. There we go. Was this the trench version or the... 
I don't know what version I've got here of the gun. I'll find out when I die. <laughs> I think it's the trench version, so I'm going to hit fire with it. But if I die horribly, I know then it's not the trench version. It's the other version, so... There we go. It should tell you what the gun is. Yeah, I have a bomb. No? Oh, there's someone who did throw a bomb up. I've just been injured by it. Oh, I'm not gonna wait. Let's go this way. Hmm. Okay. Why are you hiding there, my friend? The fight is not over there. Why are these guys just hiding? Really? This, I think this is definitely that one. <laughs> Unlock. Sorry, buddy. I did try and help you out there, but someone locked the door. Oh. Thank you. Thank you, teammate, for the assistance, sir. Uh, Okay, well, I'm going to go this way. Um, oh, no, it's a teammate. I heard him and I was like, oh, enemy. But it's not, it's a teammate, luckily. Right. So this is going to change the whole dynamic of the game, in a way. And especially if they add more in, because I'm definitely sure they'll add more perks in. Throw a grenade there. Yeah, I bet, buddy. Die again. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> I was being a little bit greedy there. I shouldn't have tried to keep on attempting, but hey, ho. I like to. I like the challenge. Um, I can hear people this way. Not sure if they're enemies, but we'll go have a looky. Oh, yep, that's an enemy for sure. You have a bomb. Let me just uh, heal them up. Uh, reload a moment. Don't mind me. You won't be my MLE. My MLE is MLG. No. Oh, it was behind me. I, I thought it was the guy downstairs. I was like, yes, you're mine, son. But, okay. Mm -hmm. So, not too much change in this gun. You can die now, my friend. There you go. Yeah, you're a bit stuck. Oh, you're free now, friend. You're free. <laughs> what are these guys doing? They're fighting up the window. Get out my way. It's my window. Let's have a look up here. Just bear me a second. Just listening. Seeing what's going on. This is my little boy. Doing his plate spinning thing, I believe. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nice. I know I, I'll, I can't give you ammo at the moment, my friend. 
Ah. Behind you. Tell your mama saved your life. Ah. Get out of it. Here, munition for this. No. Yeah, have a grenade. There we go, we got him. Jesus Christ, what the hell is going on here? There's so much going on right now. I'll say throw bombs down there, guys. That's it. Wait, I got some bombs. Um, I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> he seems to scream when his plate's spinning. He likes to spin all the pan lids. And uh, he's obviously doing it downstairs while my partner's doing whatever she's doing. I'm not sure. There we go. I'll have a bomb. Yeah, there's some ammo there for you guys. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, we're down the end of the corridor. You got him, guys? Yep, you got him. Okay, looks like we've finally stopped them from coming through. But that was crazy. They're all bottlenecks in that one area. They have a grenade. Oh, yes, I got some on. Awesome. Yeah, mate, I have some ammo. You? Yeah, you're friendly. Um, let's go this way. No, but it is. Okay. Let's charge into battle. And there we go. We got a victory. So there we go guys, that is Battlefield 1. So there's new updates, new perks, new everything in this game now, apparently, if that's a thing. So I'm not too sure. I'm. This is my first day back on Battlefield 1, so I kind of need to work out what these perks are and if there is any of the sort of like OP versions of perks. We know there's new guns in the game as well, so that's going to be interesting. We're going to try and get them as well, so that's pretty cool. So if you did enjoy this guys, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And we went 20 and 2 in this gameplay. So there we go. 20 and 2. But let's back out now and actually have a look at these weapons. So how do we back out? There we go. Quit. Yes, we want to quit. Thank you very much. So I'll have a quick look at these new weapons and perks guys and then we'll leave it there but I never knew there was such a big update. I knew there was some sort of balancing that was going to do to the Automatico. There was going to do a bit of balancing obviously to the others as well as the Medic and make the Medic a little bit better because the Medic seems to be the weakest of uh, the choice apparently. A lot of people felt that the Medic's just not that good. Uh, which I kind of understand in a way because the worst thing for me for medic was the reloading time. You get a kill, you literally couldn't get another kill afterwards. You would literally be taking however many seconds it took to reload your gun, and by the time you've done that, if someone's running at you, you ain't got a choice. You know, there's no chance of you being able to actually do anything in terms of fighting back against them. So how do you unlock this new assignment, apparently? That's the big question. 
I don't know because it doesn't really tell you. It would be nice to have some sort of information on there, but I know you guys will tell me anyway. Storm the doors. Multiplayer. Can I not look at the individual player without joining? What about if I set up a custom game? Will that help? I don't know. We'll leave it for now. Because otherwise I'll have to join into another game. But we'll, we'll have a look at it when we get into game to check out the the rest of the weapons and everything and see what there is. You know, because that is kind of weird. You know, with all the changes that they've added in and all the new weapons. Pretty interesting. Pretty interesting and with the perks as well I'm not sure how that's gonna play but let me know guys in the comments below what do you think to it well you know who it is guys it is I the Kappa convict I'm sending out guys and as always I salute you at home and I'll see you in the next video bye for now